Hi there, if you want to connect your mobile phone as a webcam to your computer with your USB cable but not with Wi-Fi, so stay with me, I will show you the way. Hi there, welcome to Crypto Studio and today I want to show you how to connect your mobile phone as a uh, webcam to your PC but in uh, a kind of USB cable uh, wired way because as you know when you connect your mobile phone to uh, your PC with Wi-Fi for webcam uh, the, the video doesn't have that stability and uh, the video is somehow vibrating moving around sometimes it doesn't show anything sometimes it stops but when you connect your mobile phone as a webcam uh, with USB cable to your PC all these things are gone and then there won't be any dysregulation or any problem and your webcam video resolution webcam a video frame everything is stable and you can have a good quality afterwards so my suggestion to you is to uh, come to this site I, I have actually put the link in the description below this is something like um, e2esoft.com something like that there is a software called IV cam and you can download it for your PC first and then you can come and download it for your mobile phone I downloaded that for my Android mobile phone and I'm, I'm now actually using my phone uh, as my webcam as my camera for recording this video for you uh, I have connected my mobile phone with wire with a USB cable to my PC and so after downloading and installing this based on your uh, need based on the uh, computer based on the system you have uh, and based on the operating system that you have you can download this software for your computer and then you can come and download it for your mobile phone after downloading that for your uh, PC there will be something like uh, this icon IV cam I have formerly made a short video about Irium webcam which is only for Wi-Fi connection that doesn't have that much stability uh, especially for streaming and uh, making videos for uh, platforms like YouTube but IV cam has both actually it has uh, also Wi-Fi connection and uh, cable connection but for doing the cable connection you have to do some small uh, settings on your mobile phone and then everything is done after downloading that there will be something like IV cam and it comes to your uh, desktop and then uh, you should go and download that for your uh, mobile phone after downloading there will be a kind of icon exactly like this on your mobile phone then you uh, can open that then you can open the application on the uh, computer they all sync together and the camera actually starts working but before that you have to do some settings on your mobile phone you have to go to the settings as you can see on the screen in setting parts you should come uh, to the part of about phone which is at the end of the uh, menu so when you go there there will be uh, some kinds of options actually one of that is legal information, one of that is software information, one of that is version, it differs in different kinds of phones. So, uh, mainly these three options are differing. For example, for my mobile phone, it was legal information. When you press legal information seven times uh, frequently, and then you can go to a page like developer options that is actually added to my menu, and you can see that this is for my phone. It was not version, but in some other mobile phones, especially Android operation, this is uh, version, I think. Yes, version. When you press version seven times frequently, there, there will be something like developer option or developer mode added to your uh, phone menu. Uh, for me, as you can see, it has come to the end of the menu after about phone and when i open that there is something like usb debugging as you can see in this page i found it and i turned this on for my mobile phone it doesn't have any floating option something that doesn't let this uh, option be on is floating option and you have to go to the settings and turn this floating option off as you can see in uh, in the screen because my mobile phone didn't, didn't have this option and it turned uh, that easily on and I didn't have any trouble but sometimes when you want to turn that on it says that it gives you a kind of warning that it doesn't let you turn this on because of security for turning on your floating uh, actually turning off the floating option or uh, something that is called floating something in some Android mobile phones you can go to security because mainly it is in security sometimes it is in app settings 
and different kinds of things you should uh, go and turn that floating option or floating I don't know thing something like that off I just faced it in some of my friends mobile phone when I turn that off everything solved but you should uh, know this that after turning off your floating options you need to turn your mobile phone off and on or you have to restart it afterwards uh, so that your mobile phone can work like this after doing that after debugging the USB and turning on uh, your application in mobile phone and opening the application on uh, actually desktop there will be something like this as you can see and now this is me you can see that I am just streaming with IV cam as you can see the IV cam logo is up here there will be something like in application purchase if you I, I don't know if you pay uh, ten dollar a year I don't know twenty four dollar for full version I think I don't know what the, what is that for but I think that's because of taking this logo it's not important for me it is actually the logo of the uh, I don't know their own uh, organization or something it's not that much important but if you want uh, in my opinion I don't know what happens if you buy something it doesn't have any special license it didn't show me any deactivation after a period of time like other uh, licensed programs um, but I think if you buy that this will be disappeared and as you can see I am connected through a cable and uh, my connection is stable uh, there is no um, movement in my video there's no actually uh, how can I say special uh, unusual movements it doesn't actually stick where it is it moves it's a kind of dynamic video but uh, when I sometimes connected my mobile phone as a webcam to my PC via Wi-Fi the problem was this that sometimes it would stuck where it was and then I was just telling different kinds of sentences I was uh, doing different kinds of actions and after some seconds the video would get back and um, then I would miss those parts in the video actually so that's it I hope you liked it if there is any problem in the procedure because the mobile phones are totally different you can uh, write that in the comment below then I can help you don't forget to subscribe me and send it to those who need this situation this uh, kind of connection with mobile phone this kind of connection uh, for uh, a webcam actually and wait for further videos in my channel have a good day see you later